Hey guys, it's Simon here from OneTechStop.net, and in this video we will do a quick speed comparison between Windows Phone 8.1 and Windows 10 Mobile, uh, the latest build which Microsoft has uh, just released. And yeah, on the left, left hand side we do have a Lumia 930 with Windows Phone 8.1 installed, and on the right side we do have another Lumia 930 with Windows 10 Mobile, so we do have two equal devices with the same hardware to test it, uh, which operating system is currently the fastest and more stable one. So first of all, we will turn on both devices uh, to see which operating system is booting faster. Uh, vibrating almost at the same time, Nokia logo. Um, in the previous leaked Windows 10 Mobile build uh, 10240, there was a missing boot screen. Of course, Microsoft has added this in the official build, official release build again. And yeah, but it will take, yeah, as you can see, uh, Windows 10 Mobile takes a bit longer to boot. Windows Phone 8.1 is already ready to use. And in Windows 10 the boot logo is displayed and now we have the lock screen here. So it takes a bit longer but it's still an acceptable time. Um, it will Now let's unlock both devices to see which one is faster with unlocking. Okay, pin code for my SIM card. Um, let's start over. Zero, three, seven, one. A bit faster on Venus Phone 8.1, but that's not surprising. And yeah, Microsoft will surely speed this up until the final release. Um, the start screen, biggest change, of course, here. Um, the transparent tiles on Windows Phone 8.1, the wallpaper is still displayed over the tiles. But as you can see, um, like in preview builds, scrolling is very fluent also on Windows 10 Mobile. But as you can see, if you swipe up quickly, you can't see the icons in Windows 10 Mobile for a second or so. Um, next off, let's swipe to the side, to the app list, which we have here. Um, always displayed in Windows 10 Mobile the search to search for an app, but you can also quick jump to an app. Um, let's go to S. And yeah, it's almost the same speed. And it's what I like in Windows 10 Mobile is how the letters are displayed. It just looks nicer, I think. Um, but yeah, that's the app list. Um, nothing special here. We can do searching maybe. Um, let's search for an app. Let's say Twitter and yeah, searching works fine. Both do have a search store um, link here where you can go directly to the store. Um, let's go back to the home screen and what else do we have with Windows 10? The Microsoft has introduced a new browser, Microsoft Edge. And in this build, uh, we do only have Microsoft Edge to browse the web. So it's important to see how fast Microsoft's browser really is. Uh, we do have, I have connected both devices to the same Wi Fi network. So we can test the um, network speed and how much, how fast the website is loading. As you can see, uh, Internet Explorer was starting up a bit faster, so it could load um, the website a bit faster. We will try now another website um, so that we can see if it's really faster in Internet Explorer or if Microsoft has done a good job with Microsoft Edge. So three, two, one, go. 
and it's slightly faster on Microsoft Edge, which is cool to see. Looking forward to use this browser every day. Um, next off, uh, we do have a personal assistant in Windows Phone, uh, Cortana, which now is now also available for the desktop with Windows 10. And it's an important part of the operating system. So let's fire up Cortana, three, two, one, go. And yeah, it was loading up faster on Windows Phone 8.1. But if you had a look down here, you could see that the headlines um, came a lot later, actually. And they were displayed earlier on Windows 10 Mobile. So maybe just a change here. You could listen to music di directly from here. Now you have to open the burger menu and uh, click on music search to search the song. Um, yeah, that's Cortana. Next off the phone app, which we will use a lot actually. Obviously it's a phone and okay, it doesn't have a SIM card here. Maybe it doesn't display this always. Let's try one more time. Yeah, okay. Fortunately, we can't have a look at this, but speed time. Okay, let's have a look at this one. Yeah, speed time is good here. Um, messaging app. Booting up faster in Windows Phone 8.1, but that wasn't surprising actually. Um, store app, we Microsoft has completely overhauled the store app in Windows 10 Mobile. And we will see how fast the store is actually um, starting up the new store in Windows 10 Mobile. Both take some time. Okay, but Windows Phone 8.1 is still faster here. Um, can do a search, maybe. Then you can see the suggesting which Windows 10 Mobile is doing. You can search once again for Twitter here. So as you can see, uh, Windows 10 Mobile is doing suggestions while you're searching with app icons. Click on this one here. And searching is faster on Windows Phone 8.1, but you in Windows 10 Mobile, you get actually directly to the app, which is nice, but this should definitely speed that up a bit. So um, what else do we lose, use a lot? Uh, of course, messaging services. So we will have a look at WhatsApp, which one is starting faster of these two so three two one go okay faster on the on windows phone 8.1 um let's try telegram which is another messaging app very popular in europe also faster on windows phone 8.1 but they do actually return to the start screen at the same speed another completely overhauled app is the calendar app in Windows 10 Mobile. Of course, the Windows Phone 8.1 app is starting up faster here because it's just not such a complicated app. In Windows 10 Mobile, you can do a lot more stuff with the calendar app. And you do have the burger menu, of course, and a few other things to um, so that you don't miss a calendar appointment. Another important app, Outlook Mail, which is new in Windows 10 Mobile. In Windows Phone 8.1, it was just a mail app. Um, let's start that up. Again, faster on Windows Phone 8.1, but Windows 10 Mobile is very good here. Uh, the app didn't take too long to start. And again, this is a completely overhauled app. Microsoft is doing a completely new app. And yeah, it can take some time. They still have to do yeah, They still have some time to finish that. And I think that's acceptable here this time. 
So next of the settings, um, which you can find in the action center, uh, as you can see, the action center took some time until it came down. Uh, if we expand this one here, quiet hours is again blinking in this build, which sounds strangely, but it was already in a build before this problem. And it seems now this problem has returned. However, um, let's start the settings. Three, two, one. In Windows 10 Mobile, you get a completely overhauled settings app as well. Windows Phone 8.1, we only have a list of settings here, um, which a lot of users were complaining about. And in the Windows 10 Mobile, you get a settings app just like in Windows 10, um, where things are sorted. For example, in personalization, you can find, of course, the start screen where you can personalize your start screen uh, sounds, lock screen and all that stuff. So let's go back to start screen. Uh, app list. Yeah, we have already have a, had a look at this one here. Um, what else can we have a look at? Of course, the multitasking, which takes a bit longer on Windows 10 Mobile. And yeah, you can now swipe down the apps here or press the X on the top of the app. Um, you can also do this here in Windows Phone 8.1. The app name is displayed at the bottom in Windows Phone 8.1 and at the top in Windows 10 Mobile. And I think, I'm not sure, but I think in Windows 10 Mobile you can have more background tasks, but we will see this in a second. Yeah, as you can see in Windows 10 Mobile, there's still another app to swipe down. In Windows Phone 8.1, we don't, don't have any more apps to swipe down, but we had the same apps open. So, yeah. Um, let's go back to start screen. So this was my quick uh, speed comparison between Windows Phone 8.1 and the latest Windows 10 Mobile Insider preview build, which Microsoft has released. Uh, you can drop me comments below and give me some suggestions if you want to see something else compared between Windows Phone 8.1 and Windows 10 Mobile. Uh, we will do some comparisons between Outlook, Mail apps, Calendar apps, Messaging apps, all the system apps which have been overhauled in Windows 10 Mobile. And yeah, have a look at our website and stay tuned for more videos.